This is me playing Minecraft 1.20.1 with the X-Ray mod on. And I went ahead and put myself on a spectator mode just so you guys could see how crazy this game gets with the X-Ray on. So yeah, if you want to learn how to download and install X-Ray for Minecraft 1.20.1, well, my friend, you have come to the right video. Let's get started. Okay, guys, so the first step to downloading and installing the X-Ray Texture Pack for Minecraft is actually downloading the Texture Pack. So for that, you're gonna click the second link in the description, which is gonna bring you to, of course, our written guide on how to download and install the X-Ray Texture Pack. Now, this is a very in-depth guide. For those of you that prefer to read and look at the screenshots, you could do so by reading this guide and we have frequently asked questions and stuff. But for those of you that just wanna follow along the video, all you have to do is click that second link Scroll a little bit down until you see download x-ray and then go ahead and click on that button. That is going to redirect you over here to the CurseForge website. If you have watched my videos, you know I love downloading things from CurseForge because they are pretty safe as long as you're downloading popular mods and stuff like that, like the x-ray ultimate, you're gonna be good. So anyways, once you're over here, you're gonna scroll down a little bit until you see the most recent file. As you can see right now, it says Minecraft 1.20, but don't worry because I went ahead and tried this on Minecraft 1.20.1 and it works. And usually it will still work with future updates. For example, the X-Ray 1.19 used to work with 1.19.1, 0.2, 0 0.3 and 0.4. So you get the point. We could actually download the 1.20 and it will still work with 1.20.1. And that's what we're going to do in this video. Go ahead and click on X-Ray Ultimate right there on the 1.20 and that is going to redirect you over here by the way you might be able to find the 1.20 here in all the files but as you can see it doesn't show right now so in the future if it shows in there you could click through there but as of now you're just going to scroll and click on recent files then click on that and click download this little download button here that is going to redirect you over here where in five seconds the download will start automatically all you have to do is wait five seconds and as you can see Five seconds after the download starts i'm gonna go ahead and save the file now for most of you the file is going to download automatically in my case it's asking me a way to save the file but for you it's just going to download automatically once you have the file downloaded go ahead and drag and drop it into the desktop by the way if you watch my 1.20 video on how to install x-ray it's pretty much the same thing as a matter of fact if you did watch that video you know that you could still use 1.20 x-rays on minecraft 1.20.1 because it's pretty much the same thing Anyways, for those of you that are trying to learn how to do this in 1.20.1, let's go ahead and do so. Once you downloaded the zip file, you don't have to unzip it. Don't worry, you don't have to do anything about it. All you have to do now is launch Minecraft. As you can see, I'm gonna launch Minecraft 1.20.1, the latest release, no Optifine, no Forge, just a regular Minecraft because this will work in regular Minecraft as well as on modded Minecraft. So whichever Minecraft you wanna play, just go ahead and launch it. In this case, we're gonna launch the normal one, vanilla. And now that Minecraft is open, there's something that you need to know about X-Ray. And that thing is that using X-Ray on the public server, it's kind of illegal. Unless you have permission from the admin, you are not allowed to use X-Ray on public servers. And that is where today's sponsor comes in. Apex Hosting will let you create your own server where you're allowed to use X-Ray without being banned because you will actually own your server. You could create either a Java or a Bedrock server that is open 24 seven that your friends could join without having to compromise your IP address or anything like that because this server is hosted by Apex Hosting. Now there's two amazing things that I love about Apex Hosting. The first one is that you could actually access a server console through your phone. So you don't even need to be at home to control your server. If you need to kick people out, if you need to change the settings, you could do so through your phone while you're over there at Walmart, you know? And the other amazing thing about Apex Hosting is that for those of you that use the first link in the description, you will get 25% off your first server with Apex Hosting, which 25% off is a lot. And I wish that offer was around when I created my first server with Apex Hosting. And now that you know this, let's get back into the tutorial. So now that we have the game open, we have to add the X-Ray. Go ahead and launch a world. We're gonna launch a single player world. Like I said, I don't recommend you use this on a public server unless you have permission from the admin or unless you own the server because you created it with Apex Hosting. As you can see, we are on a cave, very dark cave, but we can't see through the walls right now. As you can see, we can't see through the walls. Let's add the X-Ray. All you have to do is press escape, go ahead and click on options, click on resource packs, and then click on open pack folder. Once you see this folder, it's probably empty for you. I'm gonna go ahead and delete my file because for you, it's just most likely empty, right? So once you're in this folder, all you have to do is drag and drop the X-Ray Ultimate into this folder. Just go ahead and select it, drag and drop it. You could close the folder and go back into your game. And you should see this little thing appear here on the available side. As you can see, it says X-Ray Ultimate 1.20. But like I said, it's gonna work on 1.20.1 as you are about to see. Go ahead and click on this little arrow right here. That is going to move it to the selected side. Now click done and just let it load. And once it loads, as you can see, you have pretty much X-Ray. You have working X-Ray in Minecraft 1.20.1. And I know what you're saying right now. You are saying something like, well, but the X-Rays are kind of hard to see right now. And I know they're kind of hard to see. And I have a couple solutions for that issue. The first one and the one that requires downloading nothing extra is just pretty much giving yourself an effect or pretty much crafting a night vision potion like I'm about to do. Well, I'm not, I'm not gonna craft it, but I'm gonna give myself a potion effect. As you can see, 
If you have night vision on, you will see through the blocks and you will see all the ores. That is the first solution and you can do it within the game just by crafting the night vision potion. The second solution that you have, which is not that hard, but requires an extra step, is downloading Optifine. The only issue is that right now Optifine is not updated to the 1.20.1. So far Optifine is only updated to the 1.20. So unfortunately, we have to wait until the Optifine releases for this version of Minecraft to have Optifine installed and be able to see everything without crafting a night vision potion. Now, I do recommend that you subscribe to the channel because as soon as Optifine comes out, the same day, probably a couple minutes after, we're gonna drop the video on how to download and install Optifine 1.20.1 so you can fix this issue and also you can play with Optifine which lets you add shaders and do many many other things and there might be other solutions for this issue like maybe going to the options file and change the gamma settings within the Minecraft installation folder but I have tried that myself and it doesn't work for me maybe if you try it it works it just doesn't work for me and other solutions that people do is like downloading custom shader packs if you download some custom shader packs maybe you can make the ores shiny now if you don't know how to add shaders to Minecraft I'm gonna make sure I leave that video up right now so you can go watch that video and learn how to add shaders to Minecraft 1.20.1. So yeah, what are you waiting for? Just just go, go watch that video right now.